my own experience uh, in a studio was terrible, you know. Even though I loved the environment and I loved working in the studio, I was behind the screen and trying to sing was quite intimidating. Um, so from that I learned that really you need to be kind of sensitive to the artist and sensitive to what their needs are and to work with them and to demystify recording first of all and second of all to give them a sense of relaxation. It's a home environment, it's a relaxing environment, it's a supportive environment and it's their focusing just for their music. and I was involved in Shekinah in a music group uh, back in the 80s. Uh, we recorded in the Mint Studio in Glenageary with Shea Fitzgerald and then I got the bug for recording at that stage. Uh, so the group then recorded two more albums after that and then I recorded, uh, got involved with Liam Lawton and I recorded Light the Fire with Liam and with Liam then I, I met other people in that group, uh, Ian Callan, and I recorded with Ian his album uh, Night Winter Skies. Uh, and then I just progressed, you know, recording different people here and there. Um, I met a group called Kena and recorded their, their music um, a few years back. And then I met uh, um, Sister Mary Dunn, and I've been working with Sister Mary Dunn for some years. And in between, I also recorded my brother Jerry. His al last album was called uh, uh, Love is Patient. <laughs> focus really is to work with a musician or an artist or a group, a folk group, a choir, a band, and to get the best music out of them. Uh, that's my, 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 my real focus and that's what I'm really interested in. What I'm offering is to record people here or record people remotely. It can be an individual, a choir, a group, a band. Uh, and with the recording they'll get the master CD and the backing tracks. So if they want to perform live they'll have the backing tracks with them. First of all, thanks very much for logging in and having a look and, and, you know, give us a call and we can have a chat, a cup of tea. It doesn't cost anything to have a chat and a cup of tea. And if you're interested and if we can work something together, well then great. So, what would you say to people who are watching this? <laughs> Sorry. <laughs> so, what would you say to people who are watching this? Well, first of all, I'd say... Start the answer. Okay. <laughs> So what I'm off. <laughs> <laughs>